Hi, welcome to Moo Moo Math. Today we're going to look at exterior angles of polygons. And the first topic we're going to look at is just the exterior angle of regular polygons. Now there is a formula for that, and it's just simply 360 degrees divided by n, where n is the number of sides. Well, let's look and define what exterior angles are. So I'm going to take the side of this pentagon, and a regular pentagon means all four sides are the same, or all five sides are the same. I'm going to extend the sides out. And notice I'm going in a circular pattern, extending one side out in each direction. So each side gets extended in the same direction. Now what I've done is I've created these exterior angles. Now this exterior angle is what we're going to find the measure of. And the sum of these is 360. So to find that angle, I'm just going to take 360 and I'm going to divide it by the number of sides, in this case 5, because we have a pentagon, and that gives us 72 degrees. So that means this exterior angle is simply 72 degrees, and since it is a regular polygon, all five of these are 72 degrees. Now, let's look at the second topic, which is what's the exterior angle's relationship to the interior angle? Well, I'm going to start with a triangle that is not regular. It has three different angles on its interior, 20, 15, and 145. Notice the sum adds up to 180 degrees because that's the sum of the angles in a triangle. Now, the exterior angle has a relationship because these are a linear pair. So if the inside is 20, the exterior angle is 160. Why? Because we have a straight line right here, and a straight line is 180 degrees, so I take 180 minus 20 to get the 160. So this exterior angle, I look at the interior, I see the straight line, I said, okay, if this is 15, that is 165 because those two have to add to 180. And this obtuse angle of 145, I would subtract 145 from 180, and that gives me 35. So that's how you find the exterior angles given an interior angle. And that's the relationship. So I'm going to go back for a second to my uh, regular polygon. That means if this exterior angle is 72, I'm going to take 180 and I'm going to subtract 72 from it to find my interior, and that's 108. So each angle inside this polygon is 108, and that's how you can find interiors from exteriors. I hope this video was helpful, and you can use it to find exterior angles of polygons.